President Obama's signature is finally on the Agriculture Act of 2014, also known as the Farm Bill. Farmers now know what to expect for financial support this season, according to Jeff Dorfman, an agriculture professor at the University of Georgia. It's going to change the way they get subsidized by the federal government, and the, the government is going to pay most of their crop insurance premiums, and then the farmers, the government will pay about two-thirds, and the farmers will pay about one-third. The bill changes the 80-year direct subsidy system for farmers, which meant that farmers received a direct check from the government. Now, farmers will buy crop insurance. Dorfman says this will result in a 2% cut in government spending from the last bill. The farm bill will affect farmers in Georgia, but Jeffrey Dorfman says consumers like me and you won't see much of a difference. For most of us, we'll go to the grocery store, it'll be just like before. We won't see a big increase in food prices, we won't see a big decrease, it'll just, we won't notice. About 30% of Georgia farmers receive subsidies with an average of $26,000 a year. Dorfman says this is exactly like welfare for farmers and is not necessarily needed. I'm not sure we need to be subsidizing crop insurance and we need to be helping farmers out as much as we do. According to Dorfman, the main point of the bill is to get government out of what and how much farmers grow and making crop insurance cheap for farmers. Devin Mullis, Grady News Source.